I just want to share another win that I always do like it's a happen for me. Go for you it, know, since, since I know that we have a park code in our telephony for our business, if you go to your pack office, you know, nowadays at McDonald's here in Auckland, everybody's at McDonald's all the time and it's filled with people and they're not together like 10 or they're sitting in their car. Guess what I do? I'm not ashamed of anything because it's my business and I need them to know my business. So I just walk up to one uh, uh, Kaumatuas or Kuya, I say, Fire, oh, are you here with the fire now to have a Kai at Macca's? Yeah. I say, oh, I've got a barcode. So I opened the barcode in my back office business and I said to Fire, if you can take a photo of this, you know what I'm trying to share, it's all in it through my uh, digital uh, business card. And Fire say, oh yeah, we'll, we'll have a look with the Fire now. So I don't know those people. I just go and save me five minutes of having a, a long ass story with them. But I said to them, what I do apart from my job as a, 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 a kaimahi for intellectual disability, I share this on my part-time when I come to the community, when I go to the Thailand, to church or wherever, I just say talking and I just ask them to take a photo of the barcode. And they say, oh, what's this for? I say, everything I'm trying to explain to you is in there. And you just watch it and I give them my phone number and ring me back or add me as a friend on Facebook. Guess what? That's another win I have uh, last couple of weeks. I got 25 new people in my messenger um, thing through uh, ground one. And we'll just talk about the barcode that I gave out. And they're enjoying watching it. You know, never know. They might come up and they say, oh, but who shared it to you? I say, it doesn't matter who shared to you. What's matter if you sing it? And if you want to get in, then get back to the person who share this uh, wonderful uh, blessing to you. So that's another win, Mr. Paco. Thank you, uh, Fano. Just to add on to what uh, Brother Neil was saying. <laughs> you are amazing, Tamali. That is awesome. And I can literally see you doing that, man. But then all of a sudden it just went blank just for a moment and i saw me doing that i'm gonna give that a crack hey I, i'm loving it this morning we're getting some really good ideas i am gonna give Keep that going, a crack. Team. Um, Keep going. <laughs> yeah yeah because you know you you've you've got a qr code on your link me on your digi card oof wow that was awesome, Tamali. Thank you. Every, when you were talking, you should have seen the faces in the Zoom room. It was like, what did I think of that? <laughs> so that's you know, great. When, when McDonald and KFC was open and when the leaders are here, we go out for dinner late night after all the presentations. And I approach people, you know, I, I approach people. I'm not ashamed of what I have on my telephony. If they like, Facebook 24 seven. So I want them to check out what I have. Maybe it will pay them instead of them paying Facebook and other, you know, companies. So it's worth a talk. But when I found out from the training, the barcode in, in your back office, I said, oh, this will save my time and I'll share it to 200, 500 people within five seconds, you know, just click the photo, there you go get back to me and then just give my telephony. And it's faster like a bullet. Honestly, what brother Neil was talking about the, the guys playing games, I do the same. You know, when I come to those people, um, because here in Auckland, the roads are blocked and there's heaps of people walking around the workers, checking out their phone instead of doing work. I say, oh, what a nice job. You just block the road and go hard on your telephony. And he was cracking up. Then I said to him, why don't you uh, take a photo of my barcode on my telephony? And honestly, two years from now, it's a promise if you follow it, 
It will take you to a next level playing games, whatever, but you get paid for it. He said, yeah. I said, well, just take it. And there you go. I just share to anybody. I'm not ashamed of what I have. There are powerful businesses around the world. Where in the world we find 38 millions within your telephony? And I have 31 million in my back office. People that sign after me and I say, what I have is very powerful. But if I learn the knowledge from the training and everybody and how to share it, then I will share to everybody in the team how I share it. So it will help others. Papatai, sister. Papatai, Stephen and Josie. Papatai, uh, Tamali, you are wonderful. Thank you so much for sharing that. So look, we've just about heard from everyone in the room except for Jandal time, uh, Moi, Mania, and uh, Sione. Good to see you too, by the way, Mania. Awesome, brother. Morena, everyone. Morena. I just heard a lot of um, people talking about training, and here I was stuffing my face, <laughs> the camera off. <coughs> uh, but I've been listening. Um, wins. Um, for many of you know that um, I've been kind of inactive for uh, a few months now. Um, just things going on in my life that have kind of. <laughs> Uh, changed my life, rocked my life, you know, with the passing of loved ones, um, not being able to go home. Um, so big wins for me is just opening my eyes every day, um, waking up to my kids, um, being able to do what I do every day, um, just trying to better myself. Um, that's a big one for me. I I love waking up to my kids, um, even though I've got to go to work in the morning. So. <laughs> And even though they drive me nuts, um, those are big ones for me. Um, just being able to get out and, you know, unlike Melbourne. Melbourne's been in lockdown for so long. I'm here in Brisbane, so we haven't had it too bad. Um, those are wins for me. Um, those are maybe little ones for, for me, big ones for others. Um, but I've been been away for a while, and it's, it's good to see everyone's faces, new faces, old faces. Um, I was actually approached uh, a couple of weeks ago from someone trying to get me on board. Um, I was actually at home and a couple of my mates, or my little brother's mates had come over, uh, drop a car off. And they were like, oh, bro, what are you doing for work? I was, and I told them what I was doing. Like, oh, do you think you could, um, you know, spare a few minutes to have a listen to something? I said, yeah, why not? So they told me about Crowd1. Um, but them being in, in the business uh, for only a couple of weeks, um, they couldn't really explain to me um, what was happening, um, which was fine. Um, but they were trying to get me on uh, on a phone call with um, with their upline, so it was it was good to good to see that because uh, I mean it, it had been a while since I've um, been active, um, and I think that's what gave me the kick in the ass was that um, people around me were were joining the crowd. Because um, I mean, when I joined, I think we, I think we were at probably six million, seven million when I joined. Um, so there's a few more members now, um, but yeah, I think that was that was the one that um, kicked me in the ass was to um, seeing people around me, my family, friends, close friends, that were joining other teams when uh, I should have been doing the work and uh, signing them up, <laughs> but. Um, I'm back. Um, I'll be back as, as much as I can uh, with, with the workload I have. Uh, but, I mean, when I left, my heart was always here. Um, I never I never doubted it. Oh, no, sorry, I lied. I did doubt it at the start. Uh, but once learning the business, I definitely um, kind of understood the business. Once I understood it, I, I knew that this was a good place. Um, I've seen many... Um, Many things trying to come and kind of break it, break us up from crowd one, like uh, lion shares and all that other stuff. Um, but there was just all noise uh, because I could see where crowd one was going. Um, but yeah, I'm back. Uh, you'll be seeing a lot more of me, um, and um, it's good to see everyone again. Thank you.
Brother, that was a huge <laughs> win. Huge. Really, really good to hear you share uh, with us this morning. Um, the wins that you did share. Um, absolutely, just to wake up. Just to wake up and to be able to see the sun shine again on your face. Mm -hmm. See your children have these people uh, mm -hmm. that are near and dear to you. And you are in good health and you're looking fine, brother. You're looking fine and it's good to have you back.